Dear students, greetings from the Kristu Jayanti LMS team and controller of examinations office. This video tutorial will navigate you through the process and the steps to carry out your assignment submissions for the CIE component. Please continue to stay safe and stay healthy. The details regarding the assignment would be announced by the respective course teacher. Based on the task that has been given to you, you have to ensure that the assignment is prepared within the stipulated time. Please remember only handwritten assignments would be entertained. Once the handwritten assignment is ready, using mobile applications such as Tab Scanner, Microsoft Lens, you could scan the handwritten assignment and convert that into PDF. While converting into PDF, student must ensure that the file size is less than 2 MB. Just in case, if your file size exceeds 2 MB, LMS would not accept your assignment submission. Please try and compress your file to in order to reduce the total file size. Once the PDF copy with the adequate file size is ready, you can go ahead and submit the assignment through the LMS to your respective course teacher. Once the handwritten assignment is ready, the student could use mobile applications such as Office Lens or Tab Scanner. Using these applications, the handwritten assignment can be scanned and converted into PDF. While scanning the pictures, please ensure they are cropped appropriately. Also, while converting into PDF, the student has to ensure the total file size is less than 2 MB. Please also ensure that the PDF is named appropriately. Once the PDF has been named, it is ready to be uploaded on LMS. Once the PDF copy of the assignment is ready, it could be uploaded into LMS. For this, the student will have to log into their respective LMS account, navigate to the course for which the assignment submission has to be carried out, click on it, identify the assignment submission activity, click on it. Notice over here the details of the assignment, the question that is provided by the course teacher would be visible to the student. Just in case, if the question is provided to the student in the form of an attachment, the student would be able to click on the question and that would be visible to the student as a download. The details regarding the submission would also be available to the student on this particular page. In order to submit the assignment, the student will have to click on Add Submission, identify and navigate to the location of the assignment, click on Upload File, choose the file, upload this file, save changes, and then Submit Assignment. Please remember, only if the student clicks on Submit Assignment, the assignment would be available to the course teacher for valuation. The student would also have to give a verification to confirm the assignment is an authentic work. Now, the assignment has been submitted to the concerned course teacher for evaluation.